Today we're in Jeremiah chapter 41, and it's, a, it's an interesting chapter because it doesn't even mention Jeremiah. It's a chapter in which the Babylonian governor is ruling over Judah, and well, he comes to his end. Listen to the first couple of verses. Now it came to pass in the seventh month that Ishmael, the son of Nethemiah, the son of Elishiana, of the royal family and the officers of the king, came with men to Gedali the son of Ahikam and Mizpah, and there they ate bread together. Then Ishmael arose and struck Gedaliah, the son of Achim, the son of Shaphan, with the sword, and killed him whom the king of Babylon had made governor over the land. So this guy Ishmael takes out Gedaliah, who is the governor of Judah. And the reason he does it, I think, is because he was jealous, he was angry, and he came from the royal lineage of David. And he felt like if anyone should be overseeing Judah, well, it should be him. And so he sits down to dinner or breakfast or some kind of meal with him, which is usually a great sign of trust, a great sign of respect and friendship. And in the midst of that, he kills the guy. He kills the leader that the Babylonian king had put in place over Judah. It's a crazy story all through the chapter. And if I could kind of summarize what Jeremiah chapter 41 has to say to you and to me, I would say it speaks about jealousy. It speaks of selfishness. It speaks of entitlement and where that kind of stuff leads a person in their life. It led this person to take the life of another, all because he probably felt like I'm supposed to be in that seat. So here's some of the things that are occurring in this chapter, and it's things to watch out for in my life and in your life. Ambition, revenge, trust in the wrong people. Obviously, this king of, this governor of Judah, whose life was lost, he, he trusted this man. And he invited him into this meal at his home, very sacred. So you've got betrayal, you've got violence, you've got power struggle, you've got fear. And I boil it down to this, you've got the consequence of sin. It always brings death. So Jeremiah chapter 41, filled with all kind of intrigue, violence, and death. And it boils down to someone who felt like, well, they should be where someone else should be. And it doesn't ever end well when you go towards revenge and jealousy and anger instead of just waiting on the Lord to put you where he has you to be.